Okay, so the AC controller is powered up. We're gonna power up the DC. We're gonna try and capture the surge here. Here we go. Okay, so we're showing uh, 445 amps-ish, somewhere around there. So now we're going to go into regen. Where are my amps? 160, 170, 190. We're down to 1,000 RPM, 230, 270, 298, 630 RPM, 3, 350, 360. So we're 300 amps. I'm going to try and do a steady. Let's see how much we can do. Steady. I'm at 41 degrees, 45 degrees, or 42 degrees. That's 330, 327, 337, so it's surging a little bit, but not too bad. 345. Yeah, we're uh, we're surging pretty bad here. Okay, and we're at 57 degrees, 59, 61. 61. Okay, I'm smelling some uh, temperature here. 63 degrees, we're up to uh, 42, 43 seconds. Okay, there we are at about neutral throttle, we're at 35.50. Make 3600 RPM. I'm just going to let the uh, we have 35, 38. Forty, forty-one, thirty-nine. So that temperature is not bad. That's 17 degrees on the spreader. Oh yeah, I should probably take uh, this cover off. And I haven't done a uh, sync signal yet here. So somewhere around 50 seconds. Here we have a sync signal. We've got uh, 19, 20, 22, 23 transistor. We've got 38, 36. Let's try this side. 28 on the spreader. And 29, temperatures aren't very high, but 26 on the contactor, 16, 16, 17, 15, motor itself, 15, uh, that connector is at 20, 15, Seventeen, so everything looks good. We're gonna shut off the AC motor. Sorry, the DC motor. So we were up at about four thousand RPM. That's as high as we got. Uh, I don't think I need to take temperatures of anything else. So just let it spin down. So this is the new firmware, the January 22nd firmware. Uh, or, hmm, actually, I'm not sure. I loaded it on January 22nd. I don't remember what day I actually got the firmware. Put it back down to zero speed. Um, I'm at 
one amp on here, which is uh, plus or minus what I'm gonna, what I'm gonna be able to see. 122.1 and we're down to 0 0.3 amps. So when I hit, uh, hit the power switch over here, we are coming up towards uh, 50 seconds, 51, 52. We hit the button and uh, the controller has power killed to it. We're down at 0.2 amps on here. So that's as low as it went. 